important. Uh, they're mandated by the Department of Transportation, DOT, uh, to check our brakes, check uh, ADA uh, standards on wheelchair, uh, seat belts. Uh, so, yeah, well, they, they have to be done every time you get on a bus. <laughs> they have to be done. There's no hands, hips, or butts. It's really important because that will tell you the, the safety that you're going to have during your performing for your passengers and for yourself. So we need to make sure that everything is much and good on the bus. This is our strength. This is our strength. to the union the union fought for this i mean i started in 84 28 years ago when drivers that i met back then had been driving for 30 40 years and they fought for what i have so it's my responsibility to fight for the future drivers of the company also and to keep the way of living uh, we need to have more solidarity. We need to have more members getting involved. Uh, these are rough times. Uh, we're dealing with some pretty, pretty tough adversaries right now, and we need to have people participate more. We need more members to get involved. What would you say to younger operators who want to go without a union? Uh, I would say that we, we, need, we need a union. Though. We need a union so, so that way we can have those, those benefits. They're not going to make it. They're not going to make it without a union. They need to have that protection. Not just protection for themselves, but for their families. Uh, don't realize that those benefits, those medical benefits, are very important. And uh, try an or any look for a state that's a right to work state and go work there and go see the wages you're gonna get for the same work here union and the same work there non-union and see compare and that'll give you the big waking uh, wake-up call to where you're gonna realize oh my god you know they they, they do make the difference you know the difference We are smart. We are smart.